Hello. In this video, we're going to talk about a program called K Hangman. And K Hangman is a nice resource for English teachers who want to help students study and learn English vocabulary words. So we're going to go ahead and open K Hangman, and to do that, we'll move our mouse down to the lower left-hand corner to the start menu. We'll click once with our left mouse button and we'll go up to the education programs. Then we'll move our mouse over to the side and we'll move it up to K Hangman. And we'll click once on K Hangman with our left mouse button to open it. So here's the K Hangman game. And the object here is to try to guess the word um, by guessing one letter at a time um, before you have so many misses in guessing the letter properly. So let's do an example. This word has four letters. So we're going to guess the letter E. So we type in E down here where it says guess and we hit enter. So there are no E's, and you'll see that it writes the E up in the misses up here. So we know that there are no E's in this word. So I'm going to guess A. There are no A's now. And I, no I's. We'll try an O, and there's one O in this word. So it puts an O in as the second letter. So the second letter of our mis mystery word is O. Now let me try a T. And an R. This is a difficult word. So you can see we still haven't uh, guessed a second letter here. Okay, so it told us we lost. The word was wolf. But since we didn't guess the W, the L, or the F, before we had guessed all these other letters, we lost the game. So let's play again. Now before we play again, I want to point out one other thing. K Hangman has many different categories of words that we can choose from. And the category that we've chosen for right now to begin with is animals. And you can see down here it says animals. So let's go ahead and choose a different category. Uh, let's go ahead and choose space. So our category is now space, and the word has six letters in it. So let's go ahead and start again. So I tried an E. So there's one A in the word. So it puts in the second letter, A. No O's. No I's and there's one U, so the fourth letter is U. Now you can see I always like to start by using the vowels because once the vowels are in there, sometimes it helps uh, us recognize the word a little more easily, but I still don't recognize it. So a T, the third letter is a T, and let me try an S. Ah. So I think I know what the word is now. It's the category is space, and the first four letters are S, A, T, U. So I'm guessing that it, the word is Saturn, so I'm going to guess an R, and then I'll guess an N. And sure enough, we won the game, and then we can play again. So the game is really quite simple. You can choose your category. And then you just begin to guess the letters, and you try to guess the letters before you have so many misses, um, and you haven't yet guessed the word. And you'll see down here it also records how many wins and losses that I have. 
Uh, you can also change the uh, background here and this is shown up here where it says C theme. You can also choose a B theme or a desert theme. Let's go back to the C theme and you can also go to full screen by moving your mouse up to the upper right hand corner to where you see that small box there and clicking once. So you can use this in a classroom setting even and set it up as a competition with your students. And one other button I want to show you here is one called Show Hint. So if you're running out of time to make your guesses you can always click the Show Hint and it will give you a hint down here. So the hint is the second planet from the Sun. So I would encourage you to not use the hint until you've tried a lot of letters, but it is a, uh, a last chance. You can always click Show Hint and it will show a hint for you. So that's the K Hangman program. Um, again, pick a category of words, have the students move their mouse over here and enter one by one a letter and enter. And if they make a mistake, it will show up here in the misses. And the object is to guess the word before you have this many misses in the word. So I think I see what this word is. So I hope you enjoy playing K Hangman. When you're finished, you can always come up and click this small X in the upper right hand corner to finish the game. Enjoy. K. Hangman, and thank you for listening.